Quaid. Quaid. Thank you for the uh, happy early birthday wishes. This, wait. We've known each other for nine months? It's, has it seriously been nine months? I feel like I said this last time, but has it seriously been this long? Also, stream has been down. So this has been a thing. I just got it back up. But, you're a wonderful bean. You're a heckin' wonderful bean. I caught a black bass, the most metal of all fish. Oh jeez. So I got invited to somebody's island while this is going on. But I wanna finish this stuff up and then I'm gonna go check their island out. I got invited to Chemical Princess's Island. I need to add her on the switch though. But we're gonna go over here, get it this big fish. The big fish right right over here. <laughs> Also, Queen, this might look familiar because I do a lot of fishing in both games, apparently. <laughs> fishing is fun. I don't know what it is. It's really relaxing. But I'm glad we're back. Eww. Yes. No, the big one went away. We already caught one of those. I want to go over here and catch this one. This little tiny babby fish. I do hope the stream stays up from this point on. Yeah. We got a little tiny fish. Got a bitterling. Gets mad at me, but only a little. Fishing is very relaxing, and this game is really relaxing in general. Give me yes. Dang it. I, I want the big fish. Hold on, maybe it'll actually stay here if I do this. Okay, I didn't spook it too much. Oh jeez. We got a lot of stuff. I guess I'll get this one fish, and then we'll see what we got, and talk to this guy. So Queen, we're eating a switch and Animal Crossing. I want to visit your island. <laughs> Okay, we got a couple of those. No, my fishing rod. Thank you for your service, flimsy, faithful, flimsy fishing rod. Oh, hey, nice to meet you. I'm Al. Cool, so you're Booty from Goldwood. Man, that's real cool. Let's have some fun while you're here together. Aye! This island's so much nature. Every place that you look is nature. It's real neat. I can say you're forever pointing at stuff saying, That's nature! Man, it'd be real neat to live on an island like this, full time I mean. Just living life, pointing at nature, being like, that's nature. <laughs> Wanna come to my Huh? You live on Goldenwood, right? Is it like this there too? Whoa, then I g wanna go. If your as cool as you, then I wanna go, booty. I'll be waiting for you. By the way, what should I do to move to Goldenwood? So I call you Mr. Tom Nook. If I call you or Mr. Tom Nook. Oh, tell me everything. Thanks. I'll call them and say hi. Today's the best day since I found out what the Sketty was like. You don't know about that? Your girlfriend was asking about Zelda, though. She thinks it'd be cool to see. Which Zelda in particular? Breath of the Wild, or what? Also, I, I will throw this out there for the Switch and Zelda. I have heard from many people... That Breath in the Wild and Horizon Zero Dawn are very similar style games. If you like Horizon Zero Dawn, maybe you might like Zelda Breath of the Wild. It's just uh, it's, uh, a thing. I don't know what's going on with my voice with that, but don't worry about it. Oh yeah, it's Fiskitty. Let's see if there's any more bugs. I don't see any bugs. But... I should check just in case. Just thought in general, but you mentioned Breath of the Wild, okay. I am curious as to what else she'll enjoy watching you play, or potentially playing herself in the future, maybe. I don't know. It's always nice 
having people that like enjoy watching games with you like even if they don't play themselves but they're still with you it's like it's fun I don't know I don't know how else to put it it, it just is Bell bottom R and B. This is stop. So top bell point pin. Do you require assistance over? I'm ready to go home. You ready to pump the tunes and fly Soren Graves here back to Goldwood? You positive? Be very positive because I wouldn't want you leaving anything behind. I can't read today apparently. So again, you ready? I keep like looking back and forth between stream and like the, the game because of what was going on earlier. Roger lifting off November Oscar Whisker. You agree? She says to play Apex when she isn't watching though. But Apex is fun! It's a fun game! Also, Dodo Cone. Wait, ooh, before I do this, before I do this, I gotta go. Deliver some stuff. Oh heck, I need to actually... Okay, I'll do that. Let me... Actually, since I need to put in the friend code... Let's see. Add friend. Search for friend codes. Who even uses friend codes? I mean, really. It's fine. Here we go. Let me go. Let me get back into here. I wonder if she'll notice that only like three hours till your birthday, Eastern Atlantic at least. I know it's like so close. I'm excited, but I'm also spooked. Just let me know if you have any items to donate or need assistance. I'm here to help. Who? Also, I'm super excited for the Animal Crossing birthday stream. Like I'm legitimately super excited about it because I'm super curious as to what's going to happen in the game. Marvelous, what would you like to donate? Uh, all these fish. Eastern at least. Wait, did Autocrate just fill it out the Atlantic? I'm spooked. Because what if uh, I load up the game tomorrow and the characters don't know me well enough to know that it's my birthday? Because I think, I think they automatically just know, but I'm not 100% sure on that. Hooty hoo, there must be a Crucian Carp. Now, might I interest you in a few fascinating facts about your Crucian Carp? That I'm probably mispronouncing, like, terribly. Wonderful, I'd love nothing more. I wonder, do you know how to tell the difference between a Crucian Carp and a standard issue Carp? It's quite as easy to tell the two apart. One must simply locate the barbels. Or, rather, the lack of them. And just what is barbel, you ask? Well, a barbel looks, like, looks a little something like a mustache. A run-of-the-mill carp will sport this unsightly facial hair, while a Crucian carp is considerably better groomed. I tried to grow a mustache when I was younger, but I, it never did feel in quite right. All for the best in the end, as mustaches go so much better with noses than with beaks. There you have it. Fascinating stuff, no? Bravo and thank you. Once the museum is complete, it shall be displayed with the utmost dignity. So we need 13 more. Yes, by the way, I wonder if you have anything else that could be donated. And if so, might I take it off of you? I got some things. Marvelous, what would you like to donate? Oh dang, so we got two of these that we couldn't give. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five. We're not going to have them anywhere near enough. Okay, we at least have a decent amount to knock off. Eek! A stink bug. The horror, the repugnance, good heavens, I must maintain my composure. Uh, <clears throat> I beg your pardon. Bugs, I do detest them. So there's much I can tell you about the insect you apprehended. If you insist, that is. Please tell me. Ah, uh, I see. In that case, 
I dare say the name says it all. Stink bugs are known for their stench. Who? Pee you. As it happens, these crop eating pests are straw like moths to produce plants and drink the juices. And when threatened, they use a smelly chemical in their belly to release their odorous odor. Odious odor, not odorous odor. <laughs> Who? How do they live with themselves? Any hoot. My sincere thanks for your donation. And th oh, bugs are the bane of my existence. Rest assured the wretched things will get the best care, best of care here. By the way, I wonder if you have anything else you can, that can be donated, and if so, I have taken it for you. I've got some things for you. I've got a squid. Ooh, woohoo! This is undoubtedly a squid! Now, might I interest you in a few fascinating facts about your squid? Yes, please. Wonderful, I'd love nothing more. Well, first off, squids are members of the moss family, just like the octopus. Many moths like snails and clams have shells, but the squid's body is almost completely soft. The exception is a long, narrow bit of hard material going through its main body, the last remnant of its shell. Of course, having your shell inside is not a best practice. Perhaps they lost the owner's manual. And there you have it, fascinating stuff. Okay, so this will all be the same, so we don't need to worry too much about that. But... We'll at least have less than 10 after this is done. The dace. I love fish. I love these fishies. Hoo hoo, why this is a dace. Now might I interest you in a few fascinating facts about your dace? Yes. Wonderful, I would love nothing more. Dace are shiny little fish that enjoy freshwater streams. With gravely bottoms and plenty of sunlight. It's a fishy par- what a fishy paradise, until the larger fish move in and begin eating the dace. Sadly, the shiny dace are easy for other fish to spot, which makes them a popular snack. However, this particular specimen here has no need to worry. There's a strict no eating your neighbor policy at this institution. There you have it. So... I wonder how he would have reacted if I would have given him a spider. And yes, Queen, there's like tarantulas in here. Like, I, I have not been bitten by a tarantula, but I know they chase you down. I think one jumped at me before. Who do you? This must be a bitterling. Um, yes, I'd like to hear some interesting facts about the bitterlings. Bitterlings hide their eggs inside large bivalves, like clams, where the young can stay safe until grown. The bitterling isn't being sneaky, no. Their young help the bivalve. The 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 <laughs> Healthy by eating invading parasites. It's a wonderful bit of evolutionary deal making, don't you think? Each one keeps the other safe. Though eating parasites does not sound like a happy childhood, is that why the fish is so bitter? And there you have it. But Queen, it's fine. You can catch them in a little net and you can hold them in your hand and they won't bite you. Even though <laughs> that sounds like a bad idea. Oh geez, I just remembered. I put, so I have a storage area in my house. Everybody has a storage area in their house in this game, and you can put stuff in it. I accidentally, or I didn't accidentally, but I put a tarantula in there, and I haven't got it out yet. I don't know why I put it in there, but I did. It's a black bass. I would like to hear your information on the black bass, please. The black bass is a formidably strong fish, and as such is a common target for sport anglers. In some areas, there are even those who professionally catch just black bass, bass, not bass. In other areas where they are not native, they are considered an ecological nuisance. <laughs> Health, English ecological nuisance, invasive even. One cannot help but wonder who is to blame for their invasion too. And there you have it. Fascinating stuff, no? Can somebody help me English better? Because I think I just said better. It's my help you English better, because I need help. <laughs> I always need help with English, though. We only have two fishies left to give. Send hep. Hep. Who? Woohoo! This is undoubtedly a yellow perch. Now might I interest you in a few fascinating facts about your yellow perch? Please tell me. Give me the info. The yellow perch is certainly worth squawking about. Not a sight to behold. That jagged dorsal fin, those brilliant stripes, those glorious colors. Who truly it is quite the specimen. 
I don't know if I do the words good. I would be thrilled to witness it firsthand in its natural environment. The feel of Perch's peak season is winter, I'm afraid. So very afraid of winter's biting chill. And there you have it. Fascinating stuff, no. Probably one thank you. Once the museum is complete, it shall be displayed with the utmost dignity. We only have one fish left, and I'm going to go talk to the uh, two villagers we have. And then if Princess's Village is still open, or Island's still open, we'll go and visit Princess's Island. We do have one more thing for you. Also, I need to get rid of all the weeds in my island area at some point. Hoo hoo! Why, this is a horse mackerel. Now, might I interest you in a few fascinating facts about your horse mackerel? Please tell me. Wonderful, I'd love nothing more. Supposedly, the horse mackerel des derives its name from a false myth about its strength as a swimmer. The gist of it is, these fish are so powerful underwater that smaller fish can ride them as steeds. It's absurd, of course. Where would these alleged fish jockeys attach a saddle? Much less horseshoes. One does wish that people would construct their legends with a bit more scientific plausibility. And there you have it. We don't have anything else for you. I think it's whenever we tell them we don't have anything else. We need six donations though from the museum. Needless to say, I'm eager to accept your continued contribu contributions. Who? So we need six. Maybe we can get some six. Well, maybe we can get six on uh on Princess Island because I'm not sure. Like some people set the time on their switches to be different times a year, and this goes based on real time. So if they have it set up as a different time of year, it could just be a completely different time for us. Oh hey, kidders, what brings you here? What's the latest? You out for an evening stroll, kidders? What's on your mind, kidders? You met Blathers yet? Wow, does he ever love talking about fossils and fish and bugs and stuff? Like, he never stops. He just keeps talking and talking and talking. You do learn a lot, though. Okay. There's Tank. Ugh, I can't catch anything. I think the scaredy fish are just afraid of my huge bulging muscles. Kerpel! There we go. What's going on, Kerpel? Blathers is a hoot. Have you met him yet? I showed him a fossil and he just kept talking. He said it was a fossil from a super strong dinosaur. I didn't understand the rest, but wow, he knows a lot. Yo, Kerpel! What's up? I'm doing this because I wanted to get the option. Maybe it's simple with a striped TA. I get it, Kerpel. You don't want to take any attention away from those sublime triceps. I haven't actually changed clothes yet. They've just kind of existed since I started the game. I don't know when I'm going to. Also, I don't know if you know, I'm like, uh, you can design your own clothes in this game if you really want to. You can design your, like, your house's floors and walls and stuff too. Like with the design stuff. But I'm just like, I haven't touched it yet. I don't know how good I would be at that, but it is what it is. I might mess with it at some point in the near future, though. Wait, where is it? Oh, I didn't press A on that. That's a nice little fish. Okay, let's see. Hey, hey, hey. Welcome to your one and only gateway to the sky is the Goldwood Airport. I can help you out today. I want to fly. Roger. You want to head to nearby island on local play or some far off island using online play? Via online play. Gosh, let me just connect you to the old internet for some online play then. And then you just want to flap his little wings, not even touching the keyboard. I don't know, I think it's really cute. I... But I, I want to touch the power button. Search for a friend code. Looking for islands you can visit. It's like you got a flight for Arakawa right now. Is that where you wanted to go? I believe so. Your gate is open. Getting ready to depart. Hi, Chemical Princess. I hope you're having a wonderful day so far. One or more other consoles are not responding. What? What? Excuse me. Hey there again. What can I do for you? 
Squeeze me. Well, it's not local. Ah! No! No! What happened there exactly? I thought for sure I was going to get to your island right then. I'm very confused. Connecting to the internet. It broke. It needs to not break. Hi, Liz. Wait. If I shouldn't have said that, I'm sorry. I said that and I immediately forgot. Like, I forgot. Ah! Ah! <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Don't mind me. It's like there aren't any islands you can they, I can we can take it to right now. What? What? It's, I, I'm glad. I, I immediately... As soon as I said, I was like, wait a second. It's okay. It's breaking. I'll wait. I'll wait. Hello, Messy. How are you doing today? I hope you're having a wonderful day so far. I did. I did a stream earlier of this, and then it decided, no, you're not allowed. To be fair, Twitch was apparently having some issues. Also, let me go over here and get that tarantula out of my house. Messy, when are you getting the game? Did you already get it? I want to know. I want to visit your house at some point in the future. You want bamboo shoots? Uh, yes please. Wait, how do I... How, how do... How do I... Send message. Oh, there we go. Yes, please. Your internet needs to stop being slow. I'm sorry, Messy. I think... I... Hmm. Ah! Hold on. I give. I give. It's so weird seeing like the message being on the right side, like they're coming from somewhere over to the right. I gotta. Oh wait. Ah, we send a message again. You can actually watch now? You closed a million apps. How many apps did you have open? But uh, did you pick up the game? Ah, I just want to say I'm about to visit another island because I already said I'd visit Princess's Island. E. It's so weird being able to just like text each other in a game like this because we have our own phones. No, messy. I'm sorry. Hold on. Actually, I'll do this. I'll do this. I'll I'll actually go. Oh jeez. Let me actually open my island. For now. It's open now. Ah! I feel like it's so bad you can only watch two seconds before it has a buffer. I'll join, I'll fly to your island and I'll message Vivi and be like, hey, I'm at another island right now. I'll be there soon, maybe. Be you, be, wait, not local. I don't. I. I hold on. <laughs> how does How does the buttons work? All right, Queen. Thank you for stopping by. I can't believe we've known each other for nine months because it doesn't feel that way, but still. Thank you again for the sub. I really appreciate it. 
I hope you and your girlfriend both have a wonderful night. And thank you again for stopping by. I really appreciate it. Let's see. Online play. Let's go. I hope it works this time. Your lag is so bad, you can only watch two seconds before it has to buff. That's insane. That's ridiculous. I'm sorry, Messi. I'm sorry. Search for a friend code. Looking for islands you visit. Looks like we got a flight for Arakala right now. Yeah, let's go. Getting ready to depart. Will it work this time? Is it fine? I'm like, fingers crossed over here. I think it's gonna work because it usually doesn't do it for a while. There's someone on the way. Ah, okay. Okay. So it's gonna tell me to wait. Heck. Can't have too many planes landing in the airport at once. Yet you can't watch this if you have a good stream. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your night. And thank you for stopping by. Whoa, it looks like we're getting interference. Hang on, someone not put their nick phone into airplane mode again. Can you check again? Getting ready to depart. Tap, 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 tap. Whoa, uh -oh. looks like we're getting interference. Hang on. What do you mean? See, we can't take off for an island if someone there is in the middle of talking or working or something. Try a few times to keep not connecting. You might want to just try it again later. Oh, if you get a hold of your host a different way, it might be quicker to send them a message. Say something like, I want to come visit, but first I need you to stop chatting and close your nook phone. <laughs> Just be sure to be diplomatic about it. Everybody gets lost in their phone sometimes, right? So, do you want me to try again right now? Yeah. It's almost done. <gasps> your communication environment could be unstable. No. Wait, what? Is it me this time? Is it me? I think it's me. I think my internet's being a hack and a half. Oh, Nintendo's having server error errors, okay. I'm gonna try that. I'm gonna try to get over here. I would laugh if the last 30 minutes of the stream ended up being me trying to get over there. Tap, 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 tap. Looks like I got a flight for Vales. You have to open your gate again? Okay. Hey. I'll. Heck. Actually, you know what? I'll go over to. Vivi's real quick. I go over to Vivi's real quick. Via online play. I want to. I want to see the meteor shower. But Vivi does have something for me. So unless it actually shows that yours this time. Look, you can come over here and lay with me. How do you want to travel? Search for a friend code or for a friend. Looking for islands you can visit, Lucky. Yeah, let's go to Vales. Let's fly. Let's get going. Bless you, Lucky. Oh, jeez. Alrighty then, you're all set. And when you need to travel, just think, what would, what would a dodo do? What would a dodo do? I think this little scene right here is always super cute, just like them. Be like, yeah. You had to reopen the gate? I'll be there soon. I'll be there soon. I'm stopping by a friend's island real quick because they're like, I got some bamboo for you. 
And I'm like, oh, thank you. I'll take it. Also, I unintentionally rhymed at the beginning. That wasn't on purpose. It's fine. Bless you, Luna. Bless you, baby girl. This is your Captain Veil. We're almost at Veil. I told you all seat to the upright position and make sure your seatbelt is secured fast, securely fastened. By the time it's 8.28 p.m. You've got clear skies and the temperature is comfortable. we are making a water landing, but that's okay because this is just... This is a water plane. A seaplane. I can read, I promise. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Um. Uh. <laughs> I do not approve. I do not approve. <laughs> I've got to catch a VV. Boop. Give me them peaches. Oh jeez. Ow! Rude. Also, just because... I might be back later. I might be back later, BB. Whoops. Ooh. How does one type? Whoops, no! You said you had a meteor shower, right? I think you said meteor shower. Ah! Ah! Mm. Whoops. How do? I'm going to check out a meteor shower. How does this work? Damn. Check out a meteor shower. <laughs> Oh jeez. <laughs> Wait, that's not how you do this. How, how does one spell? How does one do this? Why can't my brain think meteor? I honestly am just like brain... Brain broke. How do? And I feel like a dumb dumb. That's what I was messing up. I was like, this isn't right. This is not right. Spelling's hard. Spelling is way too hard, apparently. <laughs> hard but thank you e. oh wait ah what was said who said the thing just boop you later I'll, I'll give you the boops I'll give you the boops. Oh my gosh. I need a keyboard for this.
Rude. <laughs> you heck. Ah. <laughs> uh. Oh, rip. Ah. A. Rude. Oh, pfft. That was... <laughs> you can't catch me, Vivi. I'm not a bug. Alright, Chemical Princess. I'm gonna try to come back now. Howdy, always good to have visitors available. Can I help you with something? I wanna go home. Roger. Tappy 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 tappy. Getting ready to return home. Alright, clear skies to you. I have two cats on me right now. They've told me I am not allowed to leave. Saving, do not touch. If oh, Also, whenever I do play online, like off screen, I gotta remember whenever I get back on screen to be like, hey, I got these things. BRB? Okay. This is your captain. We're almost to Goldwood, so please prepare for landing. Return to your seat to the upright position to make sure your seatbelt is securely fastened. Local time is 9.34 p.m. We've got clear skies and the temperature is comfortable. Are you making a water landing? That's okay, because this is a seaplane. I really like the way it has a setup where you go to visit islands and you just like fly to each one. But, but, let's see if we can see this meteor shower that I apparently can't spell. Ooh. Got quite a lot of stuff there, or quite a lot of points there. Let's see. Can we make it this time? I want to fly. Can we... So we connect to the old internet for some play then. Connecting to the interwebs. Connecting to... Somebody's island. Do you want to travel? For a friend code. Or for... Let's search, search for a friend. Looking for islands you can visit. Oh, hang on, which island do you want to go to? I want to go to Arikawa Island. Yeah. Let's go. Getting ready to depart. Tap, 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 tap. Tapping little Lucky's head. And her back. And Luna's back. I, I, I don't know. I just really like this. Y'all set. And we need to travel. Just do think what would the Dodos do. There we go. I made it. I can I can see your island. I can see your home. I can see what it's like. It'll be glorious. I'm pretty sure it'll be glorious. Have you been time traveling? I don't remember if you have or not. I haven't I don't I just I don't know. Also I know you said you'd be right back, I'm just thinking out loud. But when do I don't when do I not think out loud? It's fine, don't worry about it. I am very curious though. As to what this island's gonna look like. What all you're gonna have on it. What characters you're gonna have on it. This is your captain. We're almost at Arakawa, so please do the things. What time is it? Other times eight thirty seven PM we've got clear skies and the temperature is comfortable. Making water landing, but that's okay. I didn't see nobody. I didn't see a soul. Nobody was waving at me. Give you the boops. I'll give you the boops. Yeah. I'll do it. 
I actually forgot to do that whenever I was on Street Sleepers Island, but she sent me one pretty much immediately, so it was like, it was good. <gasps> I saw a bug. Do I have a new best friend? I do have a new best friend. Good, very good. I want to catch this, because I don't have this. It's my bug. Yes. I caught a tiger beetle. I pounced it first. I pounced first. I did the pouncing. So you got a lot of villagers here, it seems like. That was like the same bug I just caught. Oh, you yeah, let me just knock on their door with the net. It's fine. It's perfectly fine. Wait, where, where do I go for the festival thing? Or for the meteor shower? Well, you're a new face. You from off island? Call me Flo. So, you're booty. Cool. I never forget her name. Hey, like in Arakawa. I just love the air here. It's sweet, but also has a tiny hint of sea salt. Anyway, you're always welcome here, Cha. Sing by any time you like. Sweet, I made a new friend. Making all the friends in the islands. So I wonder where everybody is. Let's see. Who's this? Teddy house. I'm finding new villagers I hadn't seen before, which is nice. I wonder if there's any that I'm going to be like, oh, I remember having this one. Take flow. Hey, hey, <laughs> did I scare you? My bad. Sometimes I get a little too pumped up and then I get a little too loud. Flo's free taker. You're here visiting, right? That's so cool. My name's Teddy. Kind of here, but I'd love to have an off island workout, buddy. Oh, nice. Bet. So there's people out here talking. They're somewhere. I know that much. But that's all I know. Let's go. Did I miss out on the meteor show? I'm on top of I'm on top of cliff. Oh, that's really cool. I see the things. Press R stick up. No tools. There we go. Oh, I need to get the ladder back out. Press A when you see a star. Okay. This is all new to me, so I'm really interested in seeing what this is like. Ah, oh, heck. I'm gonna get up here eventually, I promise. I see you. Is that one of the uh, outfits from the creator thing? You can also hear them. Oh wait, there we go. I can see the sky. No, oh, it's an actual dress in the game, okay. That's actually really neat. Who even takes their clothes off? Place up dress, I see. Give me a wish. I wish for a thing. Hello Ash Wednesday, how are you doing today? I hope you're having a wonderful day so far. I've seen a lot of people using that. Need more wishes. What what does this actually do? I'm doing pretty fantastic. I actually got Doom Eternal today and I started playing it. I played it for the first two missions and that game is really good. I absolutely love Doom Eternal. I'm glad I finally got a hold of it. Wait, is that Celeste? It, it's really good. I'm excited to play more of it. Hootie Hoot! Uh, Hootie Toot! And a very good evening to you. Are you a resident of this island? Aha! You must be the famous Booty. 
Yeah. <laughs> it's lovely to meet you. Who's the last, perhaps? You've met my brother, Blathers. He's a museum curator. It's just a glorified gore fest. I mean, you're not entirely wrong. Yes, yeah, time is booty. You know if you had. Blathy, you're... I mean, my brother likes to go on and on about everything. It's quite endearing, assuming you're not in a rush. Oh, there I go getting distracted. Came here to examine the night sky at Blather's suggestion, but... The night sky on the island is just stunning. I'm simply gobsmacked by its beauty. What's more, science suggests that tonight there will be a meteor shower. What a lovely coincidence, but... Did you not see the meteor shower happening? Have you heard that a wish upon falling star will bring you good fortune, booty? The stars above, falling all the way to Earth just to hear our wishes. Isn't that a lovely romantic idea? Look up at the sky with the right stick and you should spot a shooting star tonight. Press A to make a wish. If you do that, you might discern yourself some good fortune. Oh, I nearly forgot. I recently ran across this DIY recipe in one of my books on the stars. It seems there's a magic wand that if you make a wish and give it away, Let's see you become a whole new you. I'm trying down the recipe with the intention of trying it out later, but... I'd like to give it to you as a token of my, our new friendship. I do hope you'll try it out sometime. Ooh, nice! And if I find any other interesting recipes, I'll be sure to write them down for you. Thank you for this lovely chat. I'll show me again the next time I come to look at the stars. I didn't realize she was actually in the game. I'm really happy about that though, because I liked her in uh, Wild World whenever you did the whole constellation thing. That is right, isn't it? You did the whole constellation thing where you'd actually make your own constellations in the sky. I think that's right. I really enjoyed that. Put away, and star wand. Huh? Okay. Sweet, I learned a DIY recipe for a star wand. So does that like, it said let you change your appearance or something. Ooh. 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 I'm gonna get you. It saved, oh it saves outfits, so nice. That's awesome. Caught a man face stink bug. Reminds me of my uncle. Well, all right then. I'm glad we actually were able to get that. We have a couple now couple of new things we need for more bugs fish and fossils to actually get the museum I don't know why I just I'm sitting up here just making wishes don't mind me you got a fish got lucky. I actually did, I got the ladder and stuff from BB, which is really nice of her because I didn't have to wait on all that stuff. Now let's see. I see, I see movement. You need a string fish, they leave after March. I don't think I've seen a string fish yet. Do they appear during the day? But that would explain why I hadn't seen them yet. I'm gonna get my fishing pole. There we go. Wait, do I not have a fishing rod? I don't have a fishing rod. Heck. I need to actually make a fishing rod. Whoops. Four to nine. Okay, so they're on cliffs. Oh! There's a thing by your house. Okay. I'm going by your house. I feel really bad because I've had to do this twice now. Oh, wait, I can just shake the trees. Never mind. Don't mind me. Everything's fine. I have the things. Yes. Ooh. I like your place. I'm gonna have to 
I'm gonna have to go into your house, because I go into everybody's houses. Okay. Just need two more, I think. Might have actually miscounted and got an extra one. There we go. Should I craft something using this workbench? Yes. Yes. How, what do we need for the star wand, actually? Star fragment and large star fragment? Ooh. I'm assuming those might potentially just fall onto your island during this. Unless I'm mistaken. I had a flimsy fishing rod. I'm all done for now. I'm totally not going into your house to go through your things. I don't know what you're talking about. I would never. I would never look. What would that be? Oh, your place looks really nice. But you can get an Animal Crossing Switch? Is that like a thing where you get the... Is that like come with the Animal Crossing Switch? Oh yeah. What was, I'll just take a tiny little peek. I see. Guess it makes sense. Don't mind me, I'm just going through your stuff. I'll go. Wait, really? I would not mind. Honestly, I would really appreciate that, actually. Do you want to give that to me before I go, or do you want me to just get out of here? Do you want me to just skedaddle? I don't know why I said skedaddle, don't mind me. Okay. Oh, heck. That's a lot of messages. Uh, where are you? Where are you, princess? Are you back home? I don't know. I don't... Oh, there you are. Hi! Thank you. Thank you. Now... Oh, jeez. Lucky, what you doing, baby girl? You got your little pawpaws on the cord. Howdy, always good to have visitors to Arakala. Yeah, let's get home. Roger. You're just scared old Karash and I'll lose my wishes. So, what exactly happens with the wishes? Do they just appear the next day or something? Like, I don't know how this works. Starcraft's come on your beach. Oh, okay. So I'll have to look for that tomorrow. I can definitely do that. We'll be playing a lot tomorrow. I'll be streaming it for a while, at least. I might do it twice tomorrow. Because it being my birthday and everything, I think it'll be really fun to just do that, personally. It'll be fun. Especially since I'm getting like sushi tomorrow. Thank you. It'll be very soon. It'll just be in like two hours and ten minutes. Ooh. I want to go ahead and put my Switch in my house. My brand new Switch. I'm not going to mess around with it yet, like location wise. I'm just going to stick it in there and be like, yes. I have this really cool Animal Crossing switch in Animal Crossing. I wonder how much, like, stuff is in this game. Just for now. I really like that. That is really, really neat. Okay. Let me know whenever I can come back over. Let's see. My Nook Miles. Which has come true. Were you wishing for Nook Miles the last time you saw the shooting star? Hmm, because Nook Incorporated should grant your wish. 
More wishes, more miles. Yes, yes. 300, late night meteorite. Ooh, okay. Now, okay, I'm on my way. So we got a couple of these. I'm on my way. Ugh. I will say, I will end stream with, I'll actually come back to my, my island right at 10, deliver the uh, stuff to, uh, to, uh, what's his face, Blathers, and I'll, I'll probably come right back, honestly. Because I do want to play this a little bit longer. I don't know how much longer I'll be playing it, but... I will be. Wait, I didn't mean to do that. Whoops. I have jump six. I didn't mean to do that. But yeah, I'll probably go back there and I'll do a little bit more fishing and stuff. Or if you need or want me to do something specific, I'll do that. But... Yeah, I'll probably... Come right back in just a few minutes just to be like, bye everybody. And then hop right back into uh, your world, your island. Connecting to the interwebs, Luna. Connecting to the interwebs. I won't touch the power button, don't you worry. I might, I might touch the home button though on accident. I almost did, actually. Looking for islands you can visit. Give me that. Yeah. Getting ready to depart. I just re remembered if uh, VV is actually still on after I leave your island, I might just go boop. Not like a meet, not like at 10 o'clock, but like later on, I might just go boop and stop by your island for a minute. Getting ready to depart. Looks like we're getting. Ah, oh, we're getting interference. Can you check again? Why? The the loading simulator. It's real. Well, heck. So, oh, someone just came. All right, I'll spend a I'll spend a few minutes here, and then I'll hop back over to yours, like right after stream ends. I want to see if I can find anything real quick that I can turn into blathers. There we go. Oh, this could be another fossil. I hope this is another fossil. Do they have pitfalls in this game? Whoops. You wonder if it was me? It might have been, maybe. I dug up a fossil. I didn't break it. It might have been me. But I swear I didn't break it. Oh jeez. Hmm. Is there anything up here? Might be. Might. I'm. I'm odd. I will say that. I might have hacked something up. Honestly. It's a stink bug. Okay, we'd already seen that. Don't need no stink bugs. I really like this little tiny spot right here. Hmm.
I do like my little island. It's not, I'm not going to sit here and say it's the best island ever, but I do like my little island. There we go. Ah, I was like scared for saying I was like, wait, did I actually make my uh, fishing rod? Oh wait, I looked away for just a split second. Hmm. Go back. Oh, there's a fish right there. It's a big fish right there. There you go, little fishy. I hope it gets your attention. Ooh. I don't know if you heard Lucky. She was just slapping her little head. And I heard her. I heard her ears like slapping her head. Ooh. Yes. I got a char. Now I'm gonna sit on it. That's a new fish for me. Uh. Let's see now. Where could? Hold on. We have. Oh crap! I need to get some rid of some of the stuff. One, two, three. We have four things technically. I don't think we're gonna get the last two, especially with it being ten o'clock already. But I'm gonna go turn these into blathers, and then Princess, I'll I'll be joining you shortly after. I'm gonna go grab some food before I do that though. We'll try to catch this fish and see if it's something new. Come on, little buddy. Come on, little buddy. Yeah. Got a black bass. The most metal lawfish. Oh, wait. I already have a birdhouse. I'll swap it out. For now. I'll have to come back to sell that. Ooh. Wait, I'll do this first. It's fine. Alright. I hope you have fun doing what you're doing. Please let me know if you have items to donate or need assistance. I'm here to help. Who? Marvelous. What would you like to donate? The stink bug. He's not going to be too happy about that. Eek, a man-faced stink bug. What a wretched thing. Yeah, I'd like to learn more about this. I see. In that case, <clears throat> never mind the stink bug smell. What we have here is a bug with a face. On its back, what, what? So put the man face stink bug has markings on its shell that resemble a human face. What's that? It's his face. You cannot unnotice it. Indeed, this face might haunt you forever. At least the face will distract you from the stink. Any hoot. My sincere thanks for your donation. Though bugs are the bane of my existence, rest assured that the wretched thing will be the, to get the best of care here. By the way, I wonder if you have anything else. Yeah. Marvelous. What would you like to donate? Whoops. The char. Who do you? This must be a char. Now, might I interest you in a few fascinating facts about your char? Yes. I would love nothing more as well. The char is one of the biggest fish around, and in the world of fish, that's quite an accomplishment. They are territorial predators and therefore must constantly defend their turf from others. So when you see a large char like this one, it is likely a skilled fighter and veterans of many battles. Veteran of many battles. I better say, hope he ne never, never has cause to go to battle with me. There you have it. Yeah. So we need two, we have two more on us. Yeah. Marvelous, what would you like to donate? The tiger beetle. Eek! Tiger beetle! So what do you have to say about this? I see. In that case, <clears throat> tiger beetle is extremely fleet on foot, though it runs in a rather peculiar way. 
That is, it sprints and stops and sprints again. Gives me speedy maneuvers to run down the spray. You see, the tiger beetle, like a real tiger, is a powerful predator. I never thought of it giving chase gives me the willies. Tigers are terrifying at any size. Anyway, my sincerest thanks for your donation. Today, bugs is the bane of my existence. Rest assured, the wretched thing will get the best of care here. We need three. We need three. I do have some items. Ooh, what would you like me to assess? I'm all fluttered. Okay, what do you got to say about this? Let me see here. Hmm, indeed. Hoo hoo! After some consideration, I can safely declare this the fossil of a diplo skull. This window specimen is in superb condition. Indeed, we could be one step closer to opening our museum with a di diplo skull like this. Yes, I'd like to donate it. I'll have collection with the utmost care. I never thought I'd lay eyes upon such a well preserved diplo skull. Dear me, I might give you a, a short presentation on the topic. I'm quite knowledgeable, you know. Please. Let's see. Good old Diplodocus. Diplodocus? What do we do without you? The stout fellow embodied all the best of the dinosaurs. Those sturdy legs, that magnificent tail, and above all, that extraordinary neck. Do you know that its center of gravity was such that sitting up on its hind legs was probably easy? What's more paired with its long neck, that this ability greatly increased reach for eating plants. That's of all, Diplodocus, Diplodocus probably grew its entire life, having no adult size. With that, we were all so gifted. And that is what I have to say about the at any hoot. I'll gladly accept your generous donation. Okay. So we just need two more. We need two donations. I'm going to try to find these real quick. But we won't be going for much longer. Yeah, it's just a moth. Yeah, that's just a moth. I see you, fishy. Ooh. Come on, get it. I hope this is like a new one. I got a dab, not bad. Did I give him a dab before? I don't remember if I did. I really don't remember if I gave him a dab. I hope I didn't, but I'm sure I did. Okay. Do we? Do we have something? Thank you very much. My feathers. It seems you have nothing on your person that we accept this time. Heck. Rip. That's not what I was hoping for at all. I thought we had it. Let me go up here. Hmm. I'll check this one little body of water up here. Let's just see. I'll go up here too. Well, it looks like we won't have this, uh, the, the, um, whatchamacallit, for my birthday. The museum. But, it's fine. Let me go up here actually and grab the item we dropped earlier. Do one last little attempt. If this, ends up, if this ends up being something, we'll fish for one more thing. But I don't know if it will be. Eee. Got a bitterling. I'm pretty sure we gave him a bitterling. I'm pretty sure we did. I know I said one more, but I'm going to do this. I landed right in front of it. Come on. 
this is a bitterling too. We're just gonna go. This is a bitterling. Dang it. Let it go. Let's sell the stuff. I'll sell the stuff, and then that'll be it. Hold on, welcome to the Nook stuff. I'm to meet you terminal for the Nook Incorporated. Nook Incorporated. Today accessing the Nook store will award you bonus daily miles. Three days in a row is 100 bonus miles. Okay. I don't want to do that right now. We're going to sell some stuff to you. Actually, that's something I'd like to check about if you have a moment, that is. It's a bit of a proposal, so no, now's not a good time, I understand. Completely no pressure. Sure. Very good, I'll get right to the point. I think you might be interested in collaborating on a new venture. Building a new shop. After all, Little Island community is growing and our needs are growing too. I'd to offer a much wider inventory of goods, but as you can see, I'm a bit limited in here. I've already spoken with our previous leader, of course. He agrees that we have a need. But here's the thing building materials are hard to get. So, can we set them aside for building a shop? I don't see it since we'll need those materials for residential projects, but I have an idea. I guess it's you to gather up materials from around the island, right? From the trees and rocks? Our environmental review, you will suggest that there will be zero impact to native.
Sorry about that. I'm back. I'm very, very sorry about that. I'll bring you, Pig. I'll bring you, Joey. Bring him now. Tina. Joey, I hope you're both having a wonderful day so far. Can't say we... Hope you have a fantastic stream. And I hope you have a fantastic night, Tina. And I'm sorry I didn't get to see you sooner. You don't need to die, Joey. Don't do that. Our environmental review even suggests that there will be zero impacts to native flora and fauna. Oh, but I'm getting off track. We need a lot of materials for a proper shop. We will, of course, offer compensation for your efforts. Okay. Thank you so much. I know it's a lot, but I put together a list of items I'd like to, you to gather. We'll need 30 pieces of wood, beech, regular hard, or regular wood, hardwood, and softwood, and 30 iron nuggets. I'm not concerned about where these materials come from. They could come from this island or any other. When you gather these materials at your own pace, once you have a set of something, come see me. Okay. Okay. I want to sell. Yours keeps buffering. It needs to stop. I sound like a robot. Hold on. Hold on. Nobody said this to me. Nobody called me a robot. Ooh. Hold on. Do I sound like a robot? Oh wait. Hello? Yes? Hello? Yes? It's not on my end. Hold on again. I uh, loaded up stream on my phone and I sounded normal. I wonder what happened. Like, I loaded it up on my phone, and it was just, like, perfectly fine. Of course, what exactly are you offering? I'm sorry, Joey. I'm very sorry about that. Oh, wait, I do not want to sell that. Your tablet must be letting you down. It needs to not be letting you down. We got 2,500 bells from that. I'll take it. Okay. Joey, you need to get the game. I wouldn't mind going to your island and doing random things. But... What was I want to do? Was there anything else? I don't remember if there was. It was your headphones, okay. But... I was trying to remember exactly what I was going to do, but I don't remember what it is now. But it is after 10 by like 16 minutes. So I'm going to head out now before I wake anybody up or keep anybody up. But I want to say thank you all for stopping by. Lurking and chatting. Hope you have a wonderful day. Wonderful night and I can't wait to see y'all again very soon. And Joey. I don't have money for that. I just bought Doom today. <laughs> but. Again. I hope you all have a fantastic rest of your night. And I can't wait to see y'all again very soon. We'll be back tomorrow with more Animal Crossing because it's my birthday. We'll just hang out and have fun after I get sushi. Why are they just AFK on your island with their menu open? That seems really rude. Thank you, Joey. But I'll see y'all again really soon. Goodbye, everybody. I love you all.